Okay. Uh, Roach and uh, Vesemir goes away, and I think that might be... Well, there's one more Witcher in the deck. I think we might just accept this. You should name... You should have met my cat. It's hunting... The hunting beast? I used to have uh, pets in the past. I don't have it one currently. Hmm. Let's go with the long ship. I don't know if you would consider like a. Uh, Farm animals, pets. Because I, I did have... Uh, yeah. That was more part of my life. Than regular pets. Like dogs and cats. They were obviously, like, I was... I was living, uh... Like, um... On the outskirts of town, kind of. Uh, situation. And, uh... We had, like, well, mostly chickens. And, you know, that's fine, they, like... The chickens are kind of dumb, but they're also kind of cute. I kind of like them. I like chickens. They also look funny when it's cold and they just, like, stand on one leg. I'm not sure why I'm talking about this dumb thing. Eat my cat. Air rifle and monkeys and birds. Sometimes. And crabs sometimes. Try to imagine that I failed. I need a picture. <laughs> what? You still have a pig? Because your best friend is a small child? Like a small pig or just a big big pig? The reason I'm asking this is like... I suppose a lot of people would find it hard to have an emotional connection to a bigger pig. I was actually at a... Like a... How's it called? I like a slaying of a big pig. That's kind of like, it's like almost a social event in Hungary. Uh, probably like comes from older times, you know, just like... Basically, people kill a pig, they get drunk, and that's it. So, it's kind of dumb. And I was not into that. I, I, I tried to play it cool, of course, but... I was not into the whole pig killing part, so that's it. I once had the the task of killing a chicken, and I couldn't do it. So there you there you go. So you can just type into the chat. Adam confirmed as a big pussy. <laughs> I can understand John's emotional bond with bacon. <laughs> But yeah, like, animals are like... Even if they are not as smart as like other animals, like, they can be... Well, I wouldn't necessarily say that they are good, because you might get some like... Even when like, in case of chickens, you, you're gonna get like, more aggro ones. Uh, they are like, playing their own dominance hierarchy games, which is just stupid, but that's what they do. But, you know, they're still kinda like... Yeah, this thing still, <laughs> still good. Hey, listen here, listen well. Well, that kind of reminded me of a story, but it's kind of a sad one, and I try to stay away from sad stories. Yeah. Uh, my grandmother uh, had chickens, and uh, she was losing her mind. Uh, not a pretty sight. But she, she enjoyed uh, dealing with the chickens. But she was also pretty... Uh, uh, unreliable as a caretaker for them, so... Well, she enjoyed dealing with the chickens more. And she didn't really make a good farmer in a way, because she did kill chickens in her life, of course, but... She kind of had my my approach to, to the chickens that, you know, she didn't like killing them at all. 
But we just... <laughs> nah. Well, that's it. That's the worst thing that can happen to you. Like, losing control over your body, that's terrible. Losing control over your mind, uh, that's gotta be worse. Holy crap. I, I don't know what's worse. Being locked in a useless body or just losing who you are. Uh, not a great choice. Cheap, I can slaughter, no problem. <laughs> what? How do you know this? How many sheep you killed? Sheep, now they are retarded. But they can be still cute. I've never killed a pig. Worst was we had an old horse who went blind and got art arthritis so much. Exactly, just because the animal is dumb, that doesn't mean you don't care about it. So what's our plan? Oh, that sucks. Don't be the scald. I will save. Nothing like some overseas plundering and spring. Okay. Will he play more? Okay. It would be really nice to play a seven here. So I wanna play Django Fret. Of course, we can just play Chiron X, and this is pretty tempting, because we can gain a card advantage. So, let's do that. I had to put down two horses the similar way. Of course, that shit was something. Uh... It, it just physically made. Well, I was when I was having the the party of killing the pig. I actually just made me physically ill. Of course, I tried to play it cool, but and I wasn't too into it. I was a bit of a party pooper there. Uh, can I just? No, nah, no, nah, the kraken, uh, the marauder is a bit weak. that if you have uh, chickens and eat their eggs you can give uh, shells back to chicken uh, they will eat it and get their minerals back yeah also the chickens are smart if you steal their eggs then they start hiding their eggs which is the stupidest shit ever I just want to have a fucking omelette and you're just hiding the the egg like some dumb place look at that some chickens why do that? I just want breakfast. Bastards. The guns are with us. Punch him. <clears throat> I ran away from home after my dad killed the horse. I was heartbroken. It kind of sounds like some kind of anime story. <laughs> <laughs> and I don't even watch anime. I'm just assuming. Maybe I should just uh, go about anime. Don't. Sorry that if that was an emotional moment.
Why are you a mass murderer of chickens? Well, man, I'm chickens, but sheep, uh... Uh, John. It's not okay. Sheep lives matter too. They're a lot more useful than... Alive. Uh, than dead. <laughs> okay, let's go with that. Hell, John, you're the biggest sheep hater of all time. Why you hate sheep so much? Orders are harder actually, uh, since they form a much stronger bonds with humans, generally. Honestly, that's what humans give a shit about. That's why they love dogs, like, oh yeah, look at that, the dog loves me. And if they have like a pig, they just pig... Well, except cat, like cat is the... Is the animal that for those... Well, it, it's, it's cute, but like... But cat is not as affectionate usually as a dog. And th those are the... the, the uh, oh boy. Okay. But like, pigs? Pigs are basically like, uh, dogs. But... They are certainly not, uh... Uh... Presented as such. Seriously, like, pigs are basically dogs. And... People are like, yummy. <laughs> Which is like, I'm totally on board with that. Pigs are yummy, but they're also very smart. Dogs <laughs> are so fucking stupid. You at least have to work for cat's affection. <laughs> Not all dogs are stupid. Their intelligence changes, although I didn't have too many dogs, and this is just uh, a fact that I'm aware of. Uh, I probably have to play it like that. I don't wanna put all my boosts in one guy. Uh, hey, Kiwi. I'm glad you didn't kill the chicken. God damn it. Now I told you guys that story. Now all of you will know that I'm a big puss. Unbelievable. Why did I tell that? Working for the cat's affection? That's easy. Give it food. <laughs> Being kind to animals doesn't make you less of a man. Uh -huh. Whoa, 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 that's... that's problematic. <laughs> Being kind to chicken does. <laughs> <laughs> What's that? Okay, let's go with that. Maybe we're killing a six. Back in line. Good. Bad. 
pass. Pass a Rooney. Chickens are retarded. Come on, man. You don't know chickens. They are they are pretty dumb, but they also well. Okay. You may may have a point, but they can be cute and affectionate, <laughs> but not quite on the level of dog. GG. So, we got Princess Ada. Uh, how about just kick Roach? Hmm. Go wolf back. Oh, that's good. Uh, maybe we're actually holding out to the skull is pretty useful. Uh, and create Marauder is not going to be terribly useful. Actually, yeah, not terribly useful. Let's do that. Uh, you're a tinker. It led here. Therefore, it was you that attracted and led this thought process and community. Stop down, man. Don't pit it all on me. <laughs> I didn't do it. But yeah, I guess I was responsible. Damn it. <laughs> I actually really enjoyed that. So, my... Okay. I'm, I'm not really a person that you would just say, like, more like a small talker. Like, you wouldn't really... I don't know. I'm not much of a small talker. So, I'm, I'm more like a crocodile who just pulls you into the deep. Like, no! Like, we're just gonna have, like, a big talk about some dumb things that you might not want to talk about. I don't know. I don't really enjoy small talking that much, so I guess that that's my only way to have a conversation. Oh, look at that. Arrakis Venom. Oh, good night, John. Today was a great debate. Usually I'm... Usually in the far right, being rather interesting debating on the left. It's always good to uh, challenge your beliefs. Cross the wide somber sea, I will sail. Uh, I'll just drop more guard. Still have nothing to target. Small talk is great. Talking without saying anything. I'm not a big fan of small talk. Uh, main, the main purpose of small talk for me, I'm a bit of a maybe maybe a jerk in that way. But I like that's just a normal process. That uh, I'm kind of like trying to figure out the other person. While, while doing the small talk. That's just a normal thing. So That's really not weird. I'm not really focusing on what I'm saying. I'm focusing on the other person. That what the other person is saying. Well. But it, it might not be indicative. Honestly. Because people are not that into small talk. I suppose that's the entire purpose of small talk, is just to, you know, just a little bit like, uh, test the waters, see where you can go. Even, well, I tend to, like, joke around and, like, bring up, like, interesting topics, but if, if I feel like that it's gonna be poorly received, then I'm actually not gonna do it. So, it's just not gonna work. And it's not necessarily bad. It's kind of the point of, for example, joke is that uh, it's not not you're not doing it just to like you know I'm doing joke a uh, joke anyway because that's what I like doing. But uh, don't you pester me. But to like you know like for for both of you to have fun, I think. 
I'm actually a little bit struggle with this because I want to be myself. Because th this is this is so uh, this is a very interesting topic. I was actually thinking about this that when I'm on stream, I always engage you guys. Uh, well, I don't really have like an introductionary level. Like, so this is the Adam that just like pretends to be a human, then, like, the real Adam comes, but, like, I'm just like, yeah, that, 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 that's who I am, like, I don't really have, like, that setting. Like, yeah, let's just, uh, skip that completely. And I would like to just completely eliminate that, but it doesn't make perfect sense in real life. This is what I really love about, about this chat. Some interesting conversation, always. So, what do you guys think? Should you really have, uh... Like, uh... I, th I think, like, well, first of all, I, I would say that my, my, my thought is that you really shouldn't have, like, a fake you. I feel... Although this, I didn't really believe strongly, always, that... I think, like, honesty is pretty important with yourself and and others. You know, it's it's an excellent way to grow as a person. It's also a really good uh, a fuel for for humor. You can just like honestly, you can just like say say truths, and it's just like, wow, you're so funny, or you're so confident, you're so fearless. But no, I I, I just said what it is, and and uh, people are not necessarily used to that. They're just like, wow, no that. That's just how it is. Like, I'm, I'm really, I wasn't really trying to be excessively funny. Just like I just said, "What's up?" Uh, and also, you're not focusing on just like putting up a facade. I suppose if you're you're trying to be like full on honest, because uh, actually, like when you're like uh, in a in a school or, or, or a situation or something like that. Uh, then, then you could uh, like at least I uh, when I was in school, I felt like the, like the social pressure to fit, fit in, which which makes complete sense because you're just gonna see those people all the time, and it's kind of important to uh, to to get along, I suppose. Uh, uh, that could be useful, but I don't really like that. Well, if we get any of these, it's obviously better than just the Savage Bear. I'm always 1% on me, which is fine until people like Wusu become and bo <laughs> bully me. <laughs> uh, that's what I want, want to as well, but like, how could you really... I, I would like to have that approach that you just like... That's kind of like, never met a stranger, you just like... You know, just like friendly to everybody, like uh, off the bat, just like uh, maybe warm, but more like at least not, not, not just like talking about nothing. But I think it could be tricky because like if they don't get your humor or just like it, you can, it just feels like too much. But that's definitely a good approach. I'm kind of curious what you guys think about that. The only 99% fake. Yeah, do some linguistic learning and you will start speaking literally and understanding so much more what people say. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna Google that. Okay. Oh, we're not gonna burn now. What are we doing here? Oh, this is so bad. I think we might just play a savage bear here. Oh, this is so bad. Oh, savage bear is gonna die. Fuck me. But it's probably the least bad uh, one to play here because the savage bear is gonna get blown up. Oh, fuck. It's an Ada. Oh my god, this is so damn freak. Bless. 
as it's your subconscious that creates your voice based on the thoughts you have in mind. And your logic is simply a box that you make in your head after you have an emotion for it. What? You will always decide things then justify it? Uh, I don't know. That's not the way I'm, I'm really thinking, or, or, or believe I'm thinking. Well... Yeah, let's do that. I try to approach uh, things with logic, but to bring up an unusual way to approach things that I don't really... I, I'm not really thinking like you, Artful. It's a bit intriguing. I try to approach things with logic because uh, in my life I felt like... Or at least I'm continuously or or increasingly feel like that the more emotional decisions I make, uh, the less likely that decision to be uh, solid. So I try to make uh, logical decisions, not fueled by... Well, of course, like, everything is gonna be fueled by emotions to some level. But, like, definitely primarily fueled by logic. <laughs> That's how I justify bullying John, because it makes me happy. Yeah, let's just not hit. Oh, we could have killed it. Probably that could have been pretty good. Oh, we kind of have a problem here. I want to lock stuff. But that's annoying. Locking that would be nice, but I don't think we definitely need to lock it right now. What we can do is uh, crack and create the botchling, then Chironax, kill the botchling. Of course, it's all preparing for like some dumb big Hubert that we have one way to blow up. Everyone is equally stupid, so there's that. But that's not true. When I was younger, I, I thought that I was... Uh, I was pretty smart. But I realized that was... And I was... Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty dumb. But like, I know everyone is kind of pretty dumb. Including me, so... Uh, that, that's my current view. We need competition, but also cooperation. That's the truth. How many IQ do you have? <laughs> Does it matter? If I can ask and you know. Not that smart. I did a... Well, I didn't do a proper IQ test ever. Like, I'm talking about, like, a... One you can do... Uh, like, um, 
in person, like some kind of organization, just like measures the IQ. I did uh, like a couple of uh, online tests, uh, just out of curiosity's sake. Mid range 130s for me. Interesting guess. How did you, uh, how did you really came, came to that uh, number? IQ, learn faster, doesn't mean perform better. That's true, but it kind of, it also affects what you can learn because uh, some topics for low IQ people is just going to be too damn complex. I do know that that uh, this is some, something just I, I kind of learned about that uh, people with lower IQs are are better suited for uh, simpler tasks. And you can't just like uh, like necessarily uh, like have like a I'm not even sure like I'm not I'm not really sure about the IQ score so I can't really say like oh yeah like there's like a obvious difference. I'm, I'm, that's why I was so surprised that you just like guessed my IQ like that. Uh, why just do that? Or you just like, guess the, just a certain number like that. People, tennis IQ smarter than you, sound confusing. Some around 10, 15 lower than you are the same. Think slightly lower, but equally deep. What? In ranges. Strongest and easiest test. That's most well known. Hmm. Can pull out dicks and show men's certificates. What really matters is what one does. Uh, I definitely agree with that. Uh, let's just hit the enraged Ifrit. Well, it's a reach too. Uh, so we just tried to blow up the Aquist right away. We might force out, of course, the Aquist to be used. And that's exactly the plan. As said, it only affects how fast you can learn, not what or or how well you can you will do it from your perspective what kind of work uh you did talk about i shall teach the lesson i will not forget briefly <sighs> we can blow that up I, i'm just i was just very uh Curious. I'm just still kind of impressed that you just like guessed something like an IQ. I'm not confirming anything, but that was a pretty good guess, Artful. As in two people, one in one 80 IQ and one 120, uh, learn how to mail at form. The higher IQ guy will learn faster. But as far as I know, it also very much affects uh, what can you learn like uh, lower IQ guys just uh, really struggle to learn things and I'm not uh, I don't know I, I can't really say because I don't have the experience teaching them but I, I definitely know uh, people who just like 
don't even necessarily have the the the, the discipline, the, the 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 focus to really keep learning uh, deeper topics, and not even necessarily uh, thinking about deeper topics here. But like sometimes it's just like just like damn simple things, and just like they just refuse to learn it, and that's kind of odd. Anyway, GG Grizzly Bear, ciao. Well, that was a, like a close game.